Hello and welcome back to another episode of Physics Partner. Today we are going to dive into the fascinating world of electromagnetic waves and their applications. So what are electromagnetic waves? Simply put, they are waves of energy that propagate through space, carrying electrical and magnetic fields. All electromagnetic waves share some common properties. They can travel through a vacuum, they transport energy, and they all move at the same speed in free space, a mind-boggling 300,000 km per second. The electromagnetic spectrum refers to the entire range of electromagnetic radiation. The electromagnetic spectrum encompasses radio waves, microwaves, infrared radiation, visible light, ultraviolet radiation, X-rays, and gamma rays. Let's start with radio waves. These have the longest wavelength ranging from a millimeter to 100 kilometers and their frequency ranges from 3 kilohertz to 300 gigahertz. These waves are used in almost all wireless communication systems including radios, televisions and mobile phones. However, exposure to high levels can lead to health problems like sleep disorders and even some forms of cancer. Next up, we have microwaves with wavelength ranging from 1 mm to 1 meter and a frequency range of 300 megahertz to 300 gigahertz. They are used in microwave ovens, radar technology and satellite communications. But be careful as prolonged exposures can lead to burns and cataracts. Let's move to infrared waves with a wavelength range of 700 nanometers to 1 millimeter and a frequency range of 300 gigahertz to 430 terahertz are used in remote controls, thermal imaging and even in physical therapy. Overexposure can cause skin burns. Visible light, the only part of the spectrum we can see, ranges in wavelength from 400 to 700 nanometers and a frequency range of 430 to 790 terahertz. It's essential for sight and photosynthesis, but excessive exposure can damage the eyes. Ultraviolet rays with a wavelength range of 10 nanometers to 400 nanometers and a frequency range of 790 terahertz to 30 petahertz are used in sterilization and security marking. However, they can cause skin cancer and eye damage. X-rays with a wavelength range of 0.01 to 10 nanometers and a frequency range of 30 petahertz to 30 exahertz are used in medical imaging and treating cancer. But exposure to high levels can lead to cell damage and cancer. Finally, gamma rays have the shortest wavelength less than 0.01 nanometers and the highest frequency above 30 exahertz. They are used in nuclear energy and cancer treatment, but exposure can cause radiation sickness and genetic damage. And that's a wrap on your journey through the electromagnetic spectrum. Remember, while these waves have numerous applications, it's crucial to use them responsibly to avoid harmful effects. So I think it's enough for today. So thank you very much for listening and watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this video is useful for you. So take care of yourself and don't hesitate to write an email if you have any question, query, suggestion and even classes are required. Take care of yourself. Meanwhile, see you in the next video. Goodbye.